Good morning. It's a new day. The Lord has woken us up. That means there's more for us to do. So it's time to rise and shine and give God the glory, glory, rise and shine and give God the glory, glory, rise and shine and give God the glory, glory, children of the Lord. It is great to be with you this morning. It's a new day and uh, the Lord has a plan for us every day. And I pray that we would go through this day keeping him first and foremost uh, in our lives. So there's been a song banging around in my head for quite some time, an old hymn. We actually sang it last Sunday, Burdens Are Lifted at Calvary. Uh, John M. Moore, a Baptist preacher. Uh, what a great, great song and a great reminder for us all. We read these words of Jesus. Matthew records them. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Oh, burdens can be so cumbersome, can be so heavy. A lot of times we carry them around and uh, don't take care of them. Uh, but today's hymn, written in 1952, um, he is serving right now as a pastor uh, at a church in Toronto, Canada, Baptist Church. And the hymn was prompted <clears throat> by experience that uh, Mr. Moore had while serving as the assistant superintendent of the Siemens Chapel in Glasgow, Scotland. One of that area's outstanding evangelistic centers. He recalls these events that led to this song. <clears throat> Moore writes this. I wrote Burdens Are Lifted at Calvary after a most interesting experience. The company's secretary of a large shipping firm telephoned a Siemens chapel and requested that I visit a young merchant seaman who was lying critically ill in Glasgow Hospital. After getting permission from the nursing sister, I went in to visit the young sailor. I talked for a few minutes and then put my hand in, in my case for a tract, not knowing which one I would pull out. It happened to be a tract based on Pilgrim's Progress, with a color reproduction of a pilgrim coming to the cross with a great burden on his back. I showed him the young I showed the young seaman the picture and told him the story in brief, adding that Pilgrim's experience had been my experience too. I explained that when I came to the cross of Christ my burden rolled away and my sense of sin and guilt before God was was removed. He nodded his head when I asked do you feel this burden on your back today? We prayed together and never shall I forget the smile of peace and assurance that lit up his face when he said that his burden was lifted. Later that night, sitting by the fireside with paper and pen, Moore says, I could not get the thought out of my mind. His burden is lifted. I started writing, but never for a moment did I imagine that this little hymn would become a favorite throughout the world. Since that time, I hear of people all over the world who are being blessed and saved through the singing of this hymn. My burdens are lifted at Calvary. His song continues to minister today, ministered to our church last Sunday, reminds us both the burdens of life and the burdens of sin. Days are filled with sorrow and care, hearts are lonely and drear, burdens are lifted at Calvary, Jesus is very near. Burdens are lifted at Calvary, Calvary, Calvary. Burdens are lifted at Calvary. Jesus is very near. Oh, cast your care on Jesus today. Leave your worry and fear. Burdens are lifted at Calvary. Jesus is very near. Troubled soul, the Savior can feel every heartache and tear. Burdens are lifted at Calvary. Jesus is very near. Oh, burdens are lifted at Calvary. Oh, what a beautiful simple 
but powerful him. So I challenge you to reach out to someone today, someone who might be burdened by sin or all the stuff of this world and share your testimony of how Christ changed you and how your burdens were lifted the day that you became one with Christ. Burdens are lifted at Calvary, Calvary, Calvary. Burdens are lifted at Calvary. Jesus is very near. He is near too. I pray your burdens be lifted today. Let's pray. Father, we love you. We thank you for this morning, this time. Together, we thank you for your word. Lord, we thank you for Calvary. And Lord, through your body hang on that cross bruised and beaten for us and your blood flowing from the wounds in your side uh, lord that through your death and burial and resurrection that we can have new life we can have our burdens lifted taken away by you oh father i pray that anyone listening to this video would would lift those burdens to you we'll let you take them and be freed from that bondage today. Oh Lord, bless us now this day. May we go forth being your light to the world around us, your hands, your feet, to those who come across our path. We love you, we thank you. We pray all these things through Jesus Christ, our Lord, and all God's children said, amen. Folks, have a blessed day and coffee on.